There is the rover. That's, that's our family selfie. And there is the helicopter successfully deployed. Robert Hogg is the deputy mission manager for NASA's Mars 2020 project, NASA's latest Mars rover. And I've been able to do this interview with Robert. He's coming to us from Mars. And so, Robert, welcome. Hey, John, how are you? I'm awesome. So this I'm is not, great. I'm not on Mars yet, but th this is our, our, uh, family, our family selfie picture. There's uh, Perseverance, the rover, and there's Ingenuity, the helicopter. That's amazing. So um, why don't you just briefly describe a bit what's, what's happening up there on Mars, because we're going to go over this in much more detail in this podcast, but just for people to just get a, a sense of what's happening there. Sure. So we have landed a, a one-ton, uh, extremely capable science rover on Mars, and we are engaged on finding scientifically relevant samples that we're going to uh, drill and then cache and prepare to be brought back to Earth all in the hope of uh, finding signs of, of ancient life on Mars. And uh, I have a, a video queued up here, if you'd like to see it, on the Absolutely. experience that we went through on uh, landing. That'd be great. All right, so let me share my screen here, and then I'll bring it up. Okay, so what you're seeing here is a... a uh, is a, a collage between the team and, and what we experienced that day <laughs> uh, on February 18th at 12.55 p.m. P Pacific Daylight Time when uh, Perseverance entered the atmosphere uh, of Mars, uh, about 170 million miles away. And one of the great things about this video is um, it's one of the first times that we've ever been able to, to see in great detail uh, what happened during this, this whole thing. So this is the parachute coming out. And there's a, the uh, slow-mo version on the left side. So what we did was we, we put um, commercial off-the-shelf cameras on the rover facing up and the descent stage facing down. And so this is the heat shield dropping away towards the planet. That's the heat shield coming off as the parachute slows us down. So now what you're seeing is the rover falling towards Mars. There's the heat shield falling away on the bottom left. And this is the closest thing that you will ever experience on, on what it would be like to, to actually land on Mars until obviously we send uh, people, uh, astronauts over there to, to do this in real life for the first time. So. So right now the rover is drifting down towards the surface and uh, Swathi, our, our uh, mission control call out person, she's the entry, descent, and landing systems engineer is describing how it's coming down. So um, Andrew Johnson uh, years ago started working on a safe and precise um, vision-based landing technology and this made it onto our project and now we are doing this in flight and essentially we have a downward looking camera that is comparing each, each image with um, dedicated hardware and comparing it to an onboard image that we took from orbiters. And we have an, this internal map that we know where there are safe places to land and where there are hazards. And so for the first time ever on landing, our rover was able to analyze where there might be hazards in its landing location and and then adjust based on that. So that move that you just saw was the uh, back shell coming off and the parachute and the divert maneuver. Uh, I believe the parachute. So I think we're on retro rockets now and we're coming down towards the location that the rover has automatically selected to, to land in. So it does that divert maneuver to get away from the back shell to make sure that it doesn't hit the, the rover, uh, the, the uh, descent stage as it's coming down. And now we're getting closer to the surface and you can see dust being blown away. And on the left, you're going to see the, 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 the descent stage there on the upper left, which lowered us on rockets, um, fly away. And as soon as it flies away, as soon as that cable is cut, then the, the video feed's gonna get cut because the, the camera that's looking at the rover is on there. And then you'll see 
there you go. The cut happened, and there's the descent stage flying away. And we, we all went nuts. <laughs> and uh, so we determined at that moment that, that it, she survived, made it all the way to the surface. And after seven years of work, we have a new, amazing, capable rover on Mars that we can go and explore Mars with and find uh, ancient signs of microbial life. That's awesome. Thank you so very much, Rob. This has been an amazing interview that we've just done, and I know people are going to love listening to it. Great. Thank you, John. Great to be here with you.